Now, BC fans will remember that Villanova game, the Notre Dame game, where he really broke out. He's been in and out of the lineup, and the hope is he's going to be in. Karnick got to it, and a one on three. It was Trey Moss on the charge for USF. Under three to play, BC on top by 11. Ashton Langford for Karnick! Exclamation mark, and the big man is sizzling. BC to the paint, Karnick, two more. Because you're moving those big guys around, they're not stationary, or can't be. Good fake. And the finish, wow! It's a highlight reel right now for James Karnick. And they've already won a couple here in Brooklyn. Post with a block. What a pass. And Karnick with a finish right in the face of Wardenberg. Zachary the assist. And then watch this pass by Makai Aston Lamper. You talk about threading a needle. And Karnick with the great finish. Really good job by Galloway of finding Karnick, and Karnick finishes. It's like a Virginia game, kind of, you know, where things seem to move quicker, and you're right. Uh, it feels like more than it is. Good pass. Galloway, beautiful feed to Karnick. You love the effort, but making himself a receiver right here. Once you collapse that defense, get into the teeth of it. Okay, play through the big fella. So now you've got a group of guys who aren't accustomed to having an answer that are literally trying to figure out in these final two and a half minutes, and it's showing. Karnick, he's got 11 to lead all scores. Karnick, bank shot good. You, you see what I saw, it could have been a pass, but Karnick being able to absorb that contact. And He's got pogo sticks for legs. Karnick with a left hand, banks it in. Nifty first few minutes, a nice post to post passing. Karnick and to post. Revan Galloway back the other way. Moore got his hand in there. BC kept it alive. Karnick, nice feet. 9-0 run. Six of the points off the turnovers. And post with a response for Boston College. And this is just great hustle right here. DeMar with the beautiful hustle play. And then right here, Karnick, uh, he is going to be beat this one. Miami leads the ACC and steals per game. You must take care of the ball and then limit transition opportunities. They use the entire shot clock, and James Carnick gets the jumper to go. And it's just tough to play against this three-quarter court defense. They've got athletes that just keeps you from walking the ball up. He does a great job. Let's get the ball down low now. Full out. You never get a chance to double team. So you can see a little help and recover. Now you have one-on-one. -on -one. You've got the whole court. No, no double team. Nice. It's actually more like a box and one on Galloway. The a drop shooter. Yeah, they're throwing a lot of different looks at this BC offense. We saw the 2 2 1, the 3 2, but Karnick has had the answer for all of them. Now, four for four from the floor. Good defense there from Karnick. And they're forcing late in the shot clock possessions by Clemson, which is exactly what BC is trying to do. Nice pass. Nice fine. Galloway to Captain Canada, who is impolite to the rim. <laughs> And Langford bounce pass, and there's another chin up. This time it's James Harding. Lead was as large as 21 just a couple of moments ago. Karnick, that's the answer BC needed. James Karnick has delivered in this second half. And this right here, high ball screen. Karnick rolls down. That is a pinpoint pass. Help is late, and Karnick. 10 seconds on the shot clock. Here's Ashton Langford. Great speed. Karnick rocks the rim. Second, third chance opportunities. Loose balls, the 50-50, and going up strong. These are big energy plays. Opportunity because TJ Bickerstaff is still out with that calf injury. Anselm with another block shot. That had it taken away. And he commits the foul that will allow Karnick. And I can't deep dive deep in the Austin cars of the world for sure, but what he's doing in this first half is incredible. Karnick, the nice feed to DeMar Langford. Makai Ashton Langford now. Drops it down for the big fella. 
James Carnick. Well, he and DeMar Langford have been the bright spot for Boston College. Beautiful spin move by Carnick. Carnick the spin and the dunk. Outstanding dunk by James Carnick. Well, he really has. He's had a solid night. Him and Langford are the only two players for Boston College in double digits. Karnick with 16, Langford with 14. Now make that 16 off the beautiful backdoor cut. Karnick has a lot of strength in the post for BC, and he's got 16. Great High pass. low with Quentin Post. What a catch. And then he puts it in. They have forced BC into 10 turnovers and kept the Eagles to 35% shooting. Really surprised with their ability to force BC to turn it over. You, BC usually doesn't turn it over as much, but... With Bickerstaff out there with his foul trouble. Karnick, very physical. And he was fired up after scoring on Shedrick. Here's Boston College. The ball in the hands of Makai Ashton Langford. Who's the top scorer for the Eagles. Bickerstaff on the baseline from Karnick. 20 points a game. We know that. I would watch just a highlight reel of his passes. Tonight, some of them have been tremendous. That one getting up the floor. After leading by double digits in the first half. Leading by two at halftime. Harnick. Foul and bucket. Here's that look. He's just screaming. He's not going to pop a whole lot. He just dives. Everybody late there. to seem a little confusion on who's supposed to roll in there behind. Shot clock at 10 for Karnick. Again, he gets the feed from Aston Langford, and he drops the hit. Aston Langford had three men on him, threads the pass to Karnick, and it will fall for the Eagles. Good job slipping over on help side. Heels on the, heels on the charge circle. Obviously, that's going to be a block. But a nice job, Karnick. Flex on him, big fella. Flex on him. Yep. Got to be set one. Looked like he was. Two. Heels can't be on the charge, sir. Karnick rolls to the cup. Body's flying. What do we got? It's a block. Chance for a three-point play. Come over. Alex Himaway, a second too late. And good recognition by Mackay Ashton Langford. Career high is 22 points. Did that against BC in BC, February 2020. Dawson's got 17 now. Great pass. How about James Garnick? Showing I can score a little bit. I'm going to dish it off. His career high is 22. Came against BC two seasons ago. Make it that for the half. Pretty footwork there by Carnick. Hey, Carnick's a nice player. Lehigh transfer has good feet. Well, Langford guarding right there, but Earl Grant's going to have a conversation with them about paying attention to the scouting report. Those were the first points of the night for Coleman on the three-pointer. Carnick again. Get a couple of plays right here. Well, I tell you, look at the dime right there. Right, put the pass in the right. For Georgia Tech as a team shot, 39%. And only made six threes on 27 attempts. Yeah, and it goes back to the, you know, oh, beautiful find from DeMar Michael Jr. He's an elite athlete. Just timed him at the rim. Brevin Calloway, he's a shooter. Couldn't connect from long range. Karnick on the offensive boards with the stick back. Go to Cali. Blocked by Karnick. Moving the ball and so efficient on the offensive end. A little push by DeMar Lankford. Karnick, the baseline drive. He has 15 points. Well, how about the defense by James Karnick? Well, they're trying to go down low for Notre Dame. We got to make sure they're one and done. We can't give up that many offensive rebounds. Paul Atkinson is swatted by James Karnick.